Hi, I'm Stuart Williams, one of the vets here at Yass Valley Veterinary. And we are proud of our brand new veterinary hospital built on the corner of the Barton Highway and Hillview Drive, Murrum Bateman. I'd like to take you on a guided tour of our new facility so you have a better idea of what happens when you come to visit us at Murrum Bateman Veterinary Hospital. We have lots of car parking spaces here. Our small animal clients can park to the left of the building, while those with horses and large domestic species such as alpacas, sheep, goats or calves in trailers can continue down to the yard behind the large animal shed. So if you have a small animal, why don't you park your car, bring your pet in either on a lead or in a basket and we'll get the tour started. Weigh your dog on the scales in the airlock as you come in. Cats are weighed in the cat consultation room. Welcome to our reception area. We ask that all clients ring for an appointment. This means that our vets can see you in a timely manner and you're not sitting around waiting for a vet who is otherwise busy in surgery or out on a large animal call. We have a dedicated area for dogs and a dedicated area for cats. Today our friendly receptionist Beck is here to welcome you and to organise your pet's file so that you're able to proceed into the consult room. So here we are in one of our two dog consulting rooms. If you have a small dog like Gypsy, we will more than likely examine your pet on the table. Larger dogs we examine on the floor. Most of the time a nurse is in the consultation room to help the vet with the examination and help record information about the consultation on your pet's computer file. We have a dedicated cat consultation room that leads off the main waiting area in the reception area. We have infusers that release pheromones that help to reduce the stress in your pets when they're in our reception room and in our consultation rooms and animal wards. We have designed this room to be comfortable and a little less clinical so that if the time comes and we need to euthanize your pet you can spend as much time as you like saying goodbye. Owners are able to leave via a side door to enable more privacy during this emotional time. This is our practice pharmacy. We carry a wide range of small and large animal medication and all the disposables that we need in our hospital. Here we are in our practice lab. This is where we analyse samples that we take from your pets. At the moment, Christy is analysing a sample on our biochemistry machine. We use this machine to check your animal's enzymes, electrolytes, proteins and glucose. We also have a urinalysis machine, a machine for checking clotting times. We use this machine to check if your dog's been bitten by a snake or has been poisoned with rat poisoning. We also have a microscope that we use for looking at skin samples, faecal samples and looking at ear swabs. The benefit of having our own lab is that we can get answers on testing we perform in most cases within half an hour. This is ideal in emergencies for our pre-anesthetic profiles and for monitoring the progress of hospitalised patients. There are some samples we need to send away to an external laboratory with the courier picking up samples every weekday afternoon at 4pm. Specialist pathologists are available to discuss more complex cases with us. This is our imaging room. We have a state-of-the-art x-ray machine that processes images in two and a half seconds and wirelessly displays them on a monitor or laptop. We're able to take this machine out into the field or over to our large animal shed where we can x-ray large animals and horses. This is one of our ultrasound machines that we use to image organs, internal masses, pregnancies in dogs and cats and also tendons in your pets. This ultrasound machine here we use on our large animals, particularly in reproduction in mares. It's ideal for scanning follicles, looking at mares' uteruses and determining pregnancies. With this introducer, we take it out into the field and we're able to preg test cows and heifers. Welcome to our treatment room. This is the room where we perform most of the procedures on your pets and is the engine room of the practice. We perform such procedures as dentals, stitch-ups, ear flushes and grass seed abscesses on these tables over here. Here we are in our operating surgery. 
This is where we perform all the spays and castrates and any other sterile or major surgery. We have the surgeon's scrub sink outside in the treatment room, the surgery table here with our bear hugger heating mat, our operating light and our anaesthetic machine. We also have a lot of monitoring equipment so we can accurately assess your patient's anaesthetic level while they are being operated on. Our machines measure heart rate, blood pressure, blood oxygen levels, core body temperature, respiration rate, and we also have an ECG heart trace to monitor the heart. Our recovery and intensive care cages are here in the treatment room, so we can easily watch and monitor your pet's recovery from surgery or supervise them closely if they require intensive care. Here we have Alicia recovering Indy after her dental, and here we have Gypsy, who's sedated, ready to undergo her dental later this morning. We have separate dog and cat wards at the Murrum Bateman Veterinary Hospital. This is the dog ward, which has access outside to a fenced exercise area. It features a reverse cycle air conditioner and keeps our patients very comfortable. So this is our cat ward, featuring its own reverse cycle air conditioner, pheromone diffuser, which ensures that Louis is very comfortable during his stay at the Murrum Bateman Vet Hospital. So that's the end of our tour. I hope you enjoyed a sneak peek of behind the scenes at the Murrum Bateman Veterinary Hospital. If you have any more queries or would like to make an appointment, visit our website at yasvet.com.au or give us a call on 6227 5955. Thank you for your time and we look forward to seeing you and your pet at the Murrum Bateman Vet Hospital.